Hello, I'm Wayne with ModularHydro.com. We're going to introduce to you the first time we, we have actually pioneered this technology. We've developed it and it works beautifully. We're going to show you how it works. How cool would it be to grow in soil with the speed of hydroponics? We've achieved that. We're going to show you how we do that. It's our air injection technology comes in many different sizes. It'll fit anything from a six inch pot all the way up to a three and a half to five gallon bucket. It's available online at modularhydro.com. But we're going to show you how the technology works. We have two systems set up. One is just growing in soil. It's nothing more than a drain tray. You see there's no water in it. Both these plants were planted two weeks ago on a Sunday, same exact day, same lighting in, indoors, and we're using uh, two CFLs to grow these plants. They were transplanted at exactly the same time, but look at the difference between the two plants. The one on this side is growing with the air injection technology for soil. This one is strictly growing in soil. You're not using any chemicals. Everything is 100% natural. You're using your favorite potting soil. And if you're an organic grower, how cool would it be to have your plants grow at a 50% faster rate? And that's what you see on this side. Look at the thickness in the stem on this plant. Look at the tuft and the flowering on the top. And actually little seeds are starting to uh, uproot, starting to show on, on the tuft up top. This plant over here, it's growing fine. If you're used to just growing in soil, that's what it normally would look like. But look at the explosive difference between this plant and this plant. Now let's show you how the technology works. What you do, and we have training videos on this, how to set up your favorite pot, whether growing in a pot with uh, drain holes on the bottom, or you're going to grow in a three and a half or five gallon bucket, a closed pot. We have top feed and we have bottom feed. So your plant that is growing in a pot with drain holes, because you have to drain your plant. Once you water it, it's got to drain out. The key is, with the air injection technology for soil, you want the soil totally saturated all the time. And let me show you how this works. As you can see here, the stem on the plant growing in the super moist wet soil with the air injection technology for soil versus the stem over here, it's twice the size. This one's almost the thickness of a pencil. This one is about the thickness of the insert on your, on your ballpoint pen. But look how robust these leaves are. Now watch this when I turn my air pump up. Watch what happens to the water level. You're going to see it increase. See how it goes up? What we're doing is we're applying more pressure into the pot internally. And remember, inside this pot there's a two inch air chamber. Okay? And we have instructional videos for you to set up whatever pot you want to uh, set up in. Whether it's a three and a half gallon to five gallon clothes bucket or it's a pot with drain holes on the bottom. Now we're going to show you the internal workings. What we did was we planted a pot in soil with the AIT. Uh, we're going to actually show you, it's a clear pot, so we're going to show you what's going on on the inside. If you look at the bottom, we have a water and air chamber separated by our sure to grow pad. We have air injected evenly up through we're using air stones. You can use hydrogen, you can use river rock, you can use lava rock, anything to separate these two and give it a good solid base. Now watch what happens when we turn the air up. And we'll talk about the benefits of this also. So keep your eyes on the top of the plant. The soil is so saturated, you can see it bubbling up through the top. So the air is completely going up through your soil, feeding your roots, and the plant doesn't, I'm going to turn it back down because I don't want it splashing on me. The plant doesn't understand the difference between growing in soil and growing hydroponically. This is how you can grow in soil, your favorite organic soil or any soil you want, and get the explosive rate of hydroponics. I mean, that is incredible. Now, let's talk about some of the other benefits. 50% faster growth rates, that's phenomenal. That's a no-brainer right there. But let's talk about bugs. When you're growing in soil, when you water your plants and they drain out, what happens is your bugs will come up out of the soil and of course they're all over the place. And we've all seen that. When you grow using this technique and this method and this technology, 
your bugs can't live in the soil. They're going to die. So what happens is your bugs actually become plant food. They suffocate. They can't come out of the plant. That is incredible. Now, you folks that are worried about spider mites, when the female lays, when the female winter, winterizes herself and goes down in the soil and then comes up in the spring and then gets all over your plants, and yes, you can have soil that has spider mites in it, you're growing in a closed environment, in a grow tent, in your house, and you wonder, how the heck am I getting spider mites? If you're growing in soil, that's what's happening. The female is coming up and getting onto your leaves and then laying the eggs. You're not going to have that with this technology. They can't live in the soil. It is just too wet. And when I crank this back up again, your soil is literally this saturated 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Now normally, a plant is going to die because the roots are going to rot. It can't get the oxygen. When you water from the top down and that water exits the bottom of your pot when you grow in soil, what you're doing is you're pulling air and oxygen down with it. At that very moment, within five minutes, your roots are up taking the best nutrients they can. Okay, after that, they're impeded. They're slowing down. That's why the plant is growing at a slower rate. With the air injection technology, the soil is so moist, the plant thinks it's growing hydroponically, but it's growing in your natural soil. So what's happening is your roots are constantly uptaking nutrients and water 24 hours a day, seven days a week. As we talked about earlier and showed you how you can grow up to 50% faster in soil using the air injection technology for soil. So basically, your plants think they're growing hydroponically. Let's talk about a few of the other benefits. You don't have the bug problem. The soil is too soaking, sopping wet. In fact, let me show you something real quick. We didn't do this earlier. I'm going to go ahead and plug my syringe down into my soil. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just pull on this lightly and watch what happens. Can you see that water coming up? If you had your soil normally this wet, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, your roots are going to rot, your plant's going to die in two to three days at the most. But with the new air injection technology for soil, that is not a problem. Now let's talk about one of the other major benefits. Your root uptake of your nutrients are constant because the soil is so saturated and so wet and you're also getting the benefits if you're growing organically. Now remember, we're not using any chemicals or anything. All we're doing is injecting air properly into the soil and you will realize up to 50% faster growth rates. How phenomenal and how cool is that? Again, I'm Wayne with ModularHydro.com. Go to ModularHydro.com for more informative videos like this and also watch our training videos how to convert whatever pot you want to use utilizing the air injection technology for soil. Thank you.